Yes. Mother Nature not being kind to no. us in the cleanup department. Scattered showers today, dropping little ice pellets and hail and grapple. It's been a lot. We've got more of that on the way, too. Just to give you the list, though, of all the tornadoes we have seen, now the count is up to nine. Mm -hmm. Just a couple minutes ago, they confirmed another one just south of Winchester in Clark County. Here's the other five that we've got already. Anderson, Jessamine, Nelson, Bourbon, Mason counties, all EF1s, 95 to 110 mile an hour max winds. We go over to Henry Boyd, Clark County. That's the newest one we have there, Clark County, just south of Winchester. EF1s with 100 plus mile an hour winds attached to them. Jeffersonville, Indiana to Prospect, Kentucky, and even maybe over towards uh, other places in that county. Um, we have an unconfirmed, potentially same tornado. EF1's on both of those, but the winds are changing. There's still a lot going on. There's still a lot of surveying being done and a lot of information still to get to. We've got these locations here in Fayette, Woodford, Spencer, and Mercer County with straight line wind damage confirmed. Whitley and McCreary County getting a survey tomorrow for potential tornadic activity. Now today, here at Jessamine County Chamber of Commerce posted this earlier on Facebook. We've had ice pellets and hail flying around in these little cold core cells that have been zooming across the area. We've got plenty of those on satellite and radar now. These are just nuisance little cells for us here as cleanup efforts continue. Each one of these that starts to get a little bit of this red and yellow inside of it could produce maybe some of those small ice pellets. And as we get into tonight, the rest of this low just keeps spinning around. We get the colder air to cycle with it. And we're talking about the chance for maybe a little bit of snow to mix in with those rain chances for your morning commute.